What's up Ozones? Welcome to the Ozone and welcome to a reaction video. Today we are going to be reacting to Dorco and D. Houston's very new song, Out of Stock. I am super duper excited for this one. It has been so long since Lonely Freddy has come out and that was a banger. So uh, I'm excited to see what this one's like. I'm also wearing my plush strap coloured jumper. That was unintentional but I just realised just now. So I think we should just get straight into this. Let's let's have a look what all this is about. <laughs> okay, out of stock lyric video. Let's go. All right. TM Studios presents Out of Stock by Dorco and D Huster. Wait, this is like the security breach area. Why is Vanessa there? <laughs> okay. It's a cover, it's a getaway. Ooh. Run and run until the latter day. Now follow up, for there's a price to pay. It's easy come, easy go, but easy on. I told you so. Like a stab in Woo! the back, it's a foul play. Can change my fate, no I like those background sounds. And logic seems to clear the my heart away. But here we go, dodging death. Cross my heart and take a breath. Help me come to realize that hope is all. Oh, wow. Okay. Help me see the okay, okay. Don't leave me in the dark. Don't leave me in the dark. Help me come to Oh, the, the, uh, the addition of the drums right there. Love it. So good. It's so simple. That's the thing. There's like, there's not much to it. I really like the effect on the voice. The guilt I took away before was easy come, easy go. <laughs> Animation is good as always. Heartbeat racing like a moving train. Rushing fears that seem to cause me pain. And logic seems to clear my hopes away. But here we go, dodging death. Cross my heart and take a breath. There's a part of me. Oh, it's building up. Come on. <laughs> These lyrics are so good. Oh, uh oh. <laughs> wow, I love how it goes back down to there. It reminds me of a band. Who does it remind me of? Oh, yeah, that bit, that bit is just so good. It gives me chills, honestly. Wow. The guitar solo? Clean, clean. <laughs> I, I like... Out of Stock is quite a good story. It's not one of my favourites, but this is doing it justice, definitely. <laughs> oh, I like that. It's toning down a little bit. Also, last time, a lot of people said that Lonely Freddy was way too short. This is longer, so that's good. God, they, they must put so much work into this. Jesus. <laughs> yes. I love it. It's such a vibe. Wow! It's still going, there's like a little chime in the background. Oh, that's great. I love that. That's so good. That's brilliant. Oh wow, that's Stitch Wraith. That's pretty cool. 
<laughs> yeah, I, okay, that is amazing. I love that. What I absolutely love, especially about Dorco and D. Houston's songs on the Fazbear Frights, is that they somehow always manage to get the song perfectly to fit the vibe of the story, right? I mean, I know I'm talking a lot about Lonely Freddy, that's like the, the main one I remember, that's like one of my favorites. Uh, and honestly, these two are probably my favorite of the entire series that they've done, but like Lonely Freddy just fit the vibe so well and you wouldn't think it would. Like it's, it's very much toned down, laid back, uh, and kind of only comes out right at the end, but um, it fit the tone really well, uh, especially for like a horror story. This one as well was kind of like very low a lot of the time, but really picked up and had those nice drums. The chorus was amazing. Uh, honestly, amazing all around, all, all around again. The only thing I will say is, is it catchy enough? I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna walk out here in an hour and I'm going to have it in my head because I don't know, I, it might have been the lyrics, it might have been there wasn't a, a big enough tune that was defined, like um, melody, but either way it was a good song, I would definitely listen to it in my free time and uh, they've done it again lads, they have done it again. So thank you guys so much for watching this reaction, uh, if you want to see more then make sure you let me know in the comments below, but thank you for watching and I'll see you later, goodbye.